Hello everyone, my name is Jermaine Grant and today I'm going to show you very quickly how to do the pan whip transition effect all inside Premiere Pro. Let's go. So as you can see, I've got the both clips in my timeline. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the effects panel and type in push. I'm going to drag this effect in between both clips. Let me zoom in for a bit. So now that I've done that, you can see that we have the transition going in from left to right, but we can make this better. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna come back into my project. I'm gonna click this icon and select adjustment layer. I'm gonna drag the adjustment layer over both my clips. I'm gonna shorten the adjustment layer so that's the length of the push effect. I'm gonna come back into my effects control panel and type in directional blur. Now with the adjustment layer highlighted, I'm gonna drag the directional blur into the effects panel, effects control panel, sorry. Come over to the blur length parameter. I'm gonna change it to about, let's say 250. No, let's say 200, I'm gonna change it to about 200. I want the direction of the blur to match the direction of the transition. So I'm going to change that to 90. That's fine. Now making sure that I'm in between both cuts, I'm going to set a keyframe on blur length. Come in about two frames and click a reset. And I'm going to do the same for the other side. One, two, and click a reset. I'm going to move this to the end and I'm going to move this to the beginning. I'm going to right click this keyframe and select ease out. And I'm going to right click this keyframe and select ease in. What this does, it smooths out the transition from beginning to end. And now we have the pan whip transition effect. Now to sell this transition even more, I'm going to add a sound effect, a whoosh sound effect. And now we have the pan whip transition effect all inside Premiere Pro. I hope this helped you out. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Comment below any other videos you'd like me to make and I will see you again next week. Take care. Goodbye. If I take it down, would you really hold me down and be your best friend? She just want to hit me with a quickie by the bullet and I'm like, yes, ma'am. Well, you got me feeling